I continue to believe it is important that uh, we work hard for a political uh, diplomatic uh, solution and to achieve such a, a solution. Uh, uh, leaders uh, uh, of, uh, from Ukraine uh, have to meet with leaders from, uh, from Russia and therefore I, I think it was important that uh, a meeting was convened here in Antalya uh, between the Foreign Minister of Ukraine and the Foreign Minister of, uh, of Russia. But of course to have any a political solution Russia has to uh, uh, stop this senseless invasion of Ukraine, uh, they need to withdraw their forces and engage in good faith in diplomatic efforts. The bare minimum is to establish uh, humanitarian corridors where uh, people can get out and humanitarian aid uh, can get in. Uh, and uh, and uh, any attack on uh, uh, civilians uh, is, uh, is violation of international law, is, is, is a war crime. A nuclear war can uh, not be won and should never be, uh, be uh, fought. Uh, 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 and, um, and this is something which actually uh, uh, Russia and uh, uh, NATO allies have uh, assigned to many times. Uh, so therefore uh, the, the, the nuclear rhetoric coming from President Putin is dangerous, it's, it's reckless. We have also made it clear that while we provide support to Ukraine and are stepping up our support to Ukraine and imposing uh, heavy unprecedented sanctions on Russia, uh, we will not send uh, NATO troops into Ukraine on the ground and not send NATO uh, uh, planes into the airspace of Ukraine because that will most likely trigger a full-fledged war uh, between uh, uh, Russia and NATO. Uh, causing uh, much more damage and, and death than we see today, It'd be even worse than the conflict we see today.